Hi, welcome to ATR. This is the ATR tray flipper developed for the U.S. Postal Service. This is what will be installed in the field uh, in existing conveyor. Uh, Mike uh, Medea, project engineer, standing behind the unit to give you a sense of scale. Overall, end to end, the machine is about 90 inches long. That includes the flipping unit, which is in the center, that's only 30 inches long, and then it's flanked by the safety enclosures on the infeed and on the exit uh, part of the conveyor to minimize access to the internal uh, rotating part. Uh, in the field, it's only the internal part, the 30 inch zone, that needs to be cut into the existing conveyor. We're going to come around there and take a closer look. The uh, tray turner is installed in the field in existing conveyor. Here the darker blue conveyor uh, would be what would already be in the field. And we make some minor modifications here. We uh, add some wide belting in here between the uh, immediate upstream two sections to get a nice smooth surface. We also add some sidebars and there's also a couple of additional sensors and reflectors. Inside the flipper unit you can see up top there is the vision camera which actually images the tray out in front on the infeed conveyor. Here again very minor modifications to the existing conveyor uh, in the field to make way for the 30 inch flipper section. Inside uh, through this interlock uh, top is the actual flipping component itself. This is a servo-driven uh, two-sided piece of powered roller conveyor that the tray will come in uh, and it gets rotated 180 uh, when necessary to rotate uh, the tray to an upside, upright condition and then it's exited out the back side of the conveyor. Uh, modifications on the exit part of the conveyor are really nothing other than guardrail to try to recenter the tray if it's uh, jockeyed around a little bit um, in uh, the process. The tray flipper turner incorporates an electronics enclosure on the side of it which has all the operator controls necessary for its operation. Uh, there's an e-stop uh, and uh, three buttons, uh, system start, uh, stop system, and pass through. All the uh, electronics for operation are included in the enclosure and this one enclosure will support a tray turner, a tray flipper, or a tray flipper turner, as we'll see here in a minute. After the start button is pushed, there will be a brief startup alarm. The conveyor unit will recalibrate, make sure it's zeroed out. When it's ready, it will induct a tray. The conveyor is zeroing its startup, and here it is flipped. Flipping performance is uh, up to 26 trays per minute. It'll handle up to a 60-pound tray without damage. 